Hello everyone. In this lecture, we are going to discussing about the example problem on the shear modulus. Let's see the problem. A hole is to be punched through a steel plate of 8 mm thickness. Find the least to diameter of the hole which can be punched if first one is the steel punch can be worked to a compressive stress of 800 Newton per mm square and the second one is the ultimate stress strength of 300 Newton per mm square. So this is the very very important model for the many competitive exam. This type of question is the repetitive question. So during the solving the these type of the problems, many students will confuse regarding the area concentration for the normal stress and the shear stress. So this is we will be discuss in this lecture. So first we have to write the given data. So given data is the so plate thickness that is the 8 mm. Let us consider the small t. And we have to determine the diameter of the hole. Let us consider small d. This is we have to determine and apply the compressive stress let us consider that is the sigma through the punch that is the let us consider sigma equal to 800 newton per mm square and also given that one the ultimate shear strength of the sheet that is let us consider tau so tau value is the 300 newton per mm square so before going to solve this problem so first we have to understand the punching operation so in the diagram we have to observe that one the here we have to keep the sheet in between the punch and die and we are applying the compressive forces through the punch on the sheet. See, first we have to keep the sheet in between the punch and die and we are applying the compressive forces through the punch on the sheet. Then the sheet will go for the deformation in between the punch and die and shearing will be occur inside the sheet then it will be separates so here during this sheet separation shear stresses it will be generate inside the sheet so along its thickness and also its perimeter shear stresses it will be generates here we are applying the compressive stresses on the sheet and the shear stresses it will be generate inside the sheet and sheet will be separates so this is the punching operation so here we are applying the normal stresses that is the compressive stresses so first we have to determine the so now compressive stress equal to applied force divided by the cross sectional area of the sheet similarly we have to determine the shear stress that is the applied shear force divided by the shearing area so now question it will be rise for the compressive stresses what is the cross sectional area for the shear stress what is the shearing area so let's see compressive force exerted that is the so cross sectional area of the sheet that is pi by 4 d square into applied compressive stress that is the sigma so compressive force which is equal to the cross sectional area into compressive stress that is pi by 4 d square into sigma Similarly, shear force required to shearing of the sheet that is shearing force, shear force let us consider the, so it should be the shear force is nothing but shear stress that is the tau into the shearing area. So here shear forces are occurred along its parameter and also along its thickness. So cross sectional area, so area of the shearing is, it should be the pi d is the perimeter and T is the thickness into the shear force or maybe ultimate shear strength. Then we have to equating the, these two equation. Then pi by 4 d square sigma equal to pi d t tau. So here pi pi it will be cancelled and d d also it will be can cancel. So from this equation we have to write down the d equal to so 4 t tau divided by the sigma. So just have to observe the given data, t also given, tau also given and sigma also given. Then you have to substitute these all in this equation, we will get the diameter is the 12 mm. And similar type of the problem is asked in the JNTU previous, uh, previous in the year of the 2019. 
so may 2019 for the five marks so let us see the question is a 3 mm thickness aluminum sheet is cut with a 40 mm diameter round punch if the punch exerts force of 6 kilo newtons what is the shear stress in the sheet you also have to equate in the forces punch exert force force that is the already given that is the 6 kilo newton so which is equal to the shearing force so shear force is nothing but shear stress into the shearing area that is the perimeter that is the pi d into the thickness so 6 into 10 cube equal to the so have to determine the tau have to determine so d also given t also given then have to substitute so it will become 6 into 10 cube divided by so pi so diameter let us consider 40 mm a thickness is the 3 mm so then just have to solve this equation you will get the so shear stress value then have to comment the answer so in the comment section so thank you very much